Hello my alien students, welcome back. Hope everyone is doing good. Actually this class came off the hook. We didn't expect it to come, but it has come. In the sense what, you know? One of my baby aliens sent me a request. John, you're doing this MEP course. I said yes. Why don't you start from architect? I said, okay, fine. That is a good idea, it is a good idea. So what I thought, you know, what I thought, Okay, you want me to start in architect, let's start in architect. So what I thought was, let's start first with AutoCAD. Okay, so from AutoCAD, so we're going to start from a blank screen. So this is what's the drawing which has been given. Okay, this is in imperial units. Okay, imperial units means inches, feet, whatever. Okay, so you can see the units all in inches. Okay, so that's the story. Just a second, make it big. So you can see it clearly, yeah. So what we're going to do is, we're going to do the MEP work for this small project. It's going to be a small project. Hmm? So we're going to start from AutoCAD. Then from AutoCAD, we're going to link it to Revit, Revit architecture. We're going to build this building. From there, we're going to do the MEP work, okay. So this is the story for the class. Let's stop the talking. Let's start doing action, isn't it? Okay. So first thing when you see this drawing, okay, I'm sure. So this our aim is going to be to do the MEP work. Okay. We will design the MEP work for this project. Don't worry. Hmm? Closet, toilet, whatever. Hmm? Yeah, I think it looks good. Kitchen. Hmm. Don't worry. So first thing is let's become an alien in architecture. Okay. From there, we're going to become an alien in MEP. Okay, it's going to be a very small baby project. My project, which I proposed for the course, would have been a big, much bigger. But anyway, a request was being sent. It will be done. Okay, one of my alien students. Anyway, so hope everyone is doing good. Hmm? Shall we start? Okay. So what I'm going to do now. It's going to open AutoCAD. Okay, but first thing what you're going to see is you're going to see this units here. Okay, so we're not going to do fine detail. We're going to make a door here. This is a sliding door. I think the thing is in this beautiful drawing. There are these dimensions. He's given here. What's this? Ah, incomplete. <laughs> Looking for the thickness of the wall. Okay, we just look at the drawing. If we don't get the thickness, we will uh, do it, assume the thickness, okay? Anyway, okay? So, I hope all good. Okay, so first thing is what you're going to do is, you're going to see the dimensions, okay? I see everything is in feet, in imperial units. Come to AutoCAD. You're going to start a new project. Actually, you'll be doing something like this, ACAD. Okay, just one random question here. What's the difference between ACAD and ACAD ISO? Okay? So, click ACAD open a blank screen okay I was doing 3d modeling before so okay so we come back to the normal human planet alien planet mm -hmm. then type units inches looks good we want it architectural okay zoom to fit okay so what we do is first thing is we're going to start placing the architectural walls okay see what i tell you is i always tell my students something like this okay what do i tell them let's go to the see the drawing i think it's this 
yeah first draw the largest part okay then draw the remaining thing so first thing is going to draw this full so it's 28 plus 8 how much is it 36 36 by 18 feet beautiful so you're going to draw a rectangle click anywhere okay what you said um 36 feet and we said 18 feet beautiful okay so we finished just a second okay so what we've done we've finished this part 28 plus 8 just just look at this dimensions okay so 28 plus 8 is how much 36 beautiful and 18 so finish this now okay and this there's another one from here 2 by 6 isn't it now my question is okay I want you to tell me one alien trick hmm? I want you to tell me an alien trick see what he's saying is from here okay let's draw this one first this is 18 by 4 from where this corner or this corner Oops, sorry hmm? from where here four feet by 18 feet okay beautiful from this corner 8 feet then we're going to have a rectangle 6 by 2 say yeah 6 by 2 okay just a second I will just bring this guy here so it's causing this headache 8 feet 6 by 2 just write it down okay 6 by 2 but we need to move how much 8 feet okay things looks good we need to do some uh, trimming we'll do it okay i think we finished the boundary so yeah the boundary of the wall So I hope this is clear. Then we'll have to do the offset. Hmm? See what you will notice is if you have an external wall. Sure, external wall will be thicker, interior wall will be thinner. Okay. 
<sighs> okay. I think we will continue the remaining part in the second, uh, next part or something. I hope everybody enjoyed this beautiful class. We just created, a, the, let's say, the outline in this video. Okay. Next part, I'll show you how to do the interior walls. You should finish this in, um, sorry, in next class or something. Okay. Anyway, hope everybody enjoyed this class. We see each other fresh in the next class. We're going to be just doing uh, the outline. It's called the offset. Okay. And then we're going to have this offset inside. We've not done this. Hope everybody enjoyed this class. I think this will be uh, two inches. Two inches is too small. Ball. <laughs> okay, anyway, we see each other in the next class. Yellow. Take care, and I think that's it.